I don't want to hear it. I don't want judgment. These are the cutest pillows I've ever seen in my life. I hope it's good. How could it be bad, right? Well, damn. Look how good this is for New Year's. I am on my mission for my sugar-free peppermint mocha creamer. Happy New Year. I am heading out to the gym, and as you guys have seen over Vlogmas, I have been loving this plastic-free native deodorant. It makes me feel really good knowing that I'm making a difference by reducing the use of single-use plastic. So this is the same amazing formula as their regular deodorant, just more sustainable packaging. So it is earth-friendly and 100% plastic-free. My two favorite scents right now are the eucalyptus and mint, which I just finished, and now I'm using the citrus and herbal musk. It's a little spicy and mixed with the citrus scent. I just love it. So I've used native products for a while now, and I absolutely love them. I was skeptical about aluminum-free deodorants for so long because I was worried they wouldn't work for me, uh, but Native has been great. And as I said, it is aluminum-free, but it's also paraben-free, vegan, and cruelty-free. The scents are all fabulous with 72-hour odor protection. It wears great all day, even after exercise. Like after the gym, I still smell amazing. You guys should definitely give Native a try. Three plastic-free deodorants would normally be $39, but if you use my link and code Rodriguez, you'll get them for $26. That's over 33% off. And with my code, you can also get 20% off any body wash or lotion. I'll put the link down below in the description box, but I'm all set, headed to the gym, smelling good. Thank you, Native, for sponsoring this portion of the vlog. Many hours later. Hey, you guys. Can we just appreciate that I've actually been wearing my hair down? I'm trying. 2023. That's the year Alex actually wears her hair down. It's funny because, like, my whole life I've been very wearing my hair very long or I chop it to a bob. But, like, I actually kind of love this length. It's kind of, like, easy to maintain. It's still a little something, something. I don't know. So, it is New Year's Eve today and Vlogmas is over. So, I think I'm gonna get back into my routinely scheduled vlogs every few days you guys know i still post vlogs like so often um and i asked you guys recently what kind of content you want to see in 2023 and i think the consensus is clear we are a vlog family i guess it's like a vlog channel i mean maybe once in a while there'll be like a sit down video there probably will be but like the majority is gonna stay vlogs because i love vlogging and i love sharing life with you guys and like doing a little video diary of life we're at starbucks i've been going to starbucks way too much lately i don't normally go this much i think it's just because it's been like the holidays and i haven't felt like I don't know i just i don't know i haven't felt like what <laughs> making iced coffee at home maybe probably because i can't find my freaking sugar-free peppermint mocha creamer anywhere and i got my regular one again the sugar-free sweet cream italian sweet cream and i like that one but like i think since my peppermint mocha is gone i've been like oh, i'll just go get a matcha i'll just go get a matcha you know so i'm gonna get my matcha and head over to target i have a rug that i got for the entryway in the house and i just I don't know I just don't love it I didn't unroll it I just kind of looked at the color and I'm like yeah it doesn't feel right so I'm gonna go return that and I need to pick up a non-Christmas doormat uh, I need to get a non-Christmas wreath for the front door because the one that I had up before I put inside the house on the stove um, hood so I need a new wreath for the front door I'll see if they have anything new I'm kind of curious if they have like some new hearth and hand studio mcgee stuff since it's like kind of that new year refresh time like they know who they're marketing to and it's me and i need just like a few miscellaneous things i have it in my phone i don't even know like turkey bacon like just like a few random things not enough to do like a grocery trip or anything like that so all right let's get this matcha and let's go to target okay so they were out of strawberry acai which is like the base of my matcha so i panicked and i got like an iced chai i do love a nice chai i get it in uh the fall with like pumpkin cold foam so i've seen people have it lately with the sugar cookie cold foam for like the winter so i don't know i panicked that's what i got we'll see how it is <laughs> um okay we got an amazing spot at target front row baby girl yes okay so let's give this a try i hope it's good i hope it's good how could it be bad right well damn 
giving me a little milk mustache okay wow i can't be drinking that all the time though that it might make me sick i don't know ice chai with the sugar sugar cookie cold foam i'm not really like even a sugar cookie girl sometimes it feels a little too sweet but it's good it kind of tastes like eggnog Ooh. okay let's go and try not to get distracted we'll see appreciate I had 5% off for my birthday surprise surprise okay so here's the wreath I got because we have these little like pine trees out on our porch so it will match and it's got like some cute little winter berries I don't know I thought it was like the perfect and it has like little eucalyptus it's just really cute I don't want to hear it I don't want judgment these are the cutest pillows I've ever seen in my life and they're gonna match our living room so well you can't see them well in this light you just wait <laughs> they are so so beautiful i think they're new with studio mcgee oh my god the joy that these pillows bring me and i want to put the ones that are on the couch on our bed so there was a point put your cart back people <laughs> all right let me show you oh no oh no oh no oh no oh no 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 okay it's fine i fixed it once we have kids we won't be able to have stuff like this because like it pulls so easily but I, I fixed it like are you kidding are you kidding babe are you kidding just appreciate this pillow, please. Are you kidding? Are you kidding? Oh, it's Isn't it? It's the new Studio McGee. Oh my God, try it. It's so good. It's um, an iced vanilla chai with sugar cookie cold foam. They were out of my matcha. Did you have this before? No, I have the fall version, but that's a Christmas version. Sure, I'm taking it. All right, enjoy. I was, <laughs> I was done with it. Too much sugar. <laughs> you knew. Guys, it's not, I'm sorry. Is this just not the most beautiful pillow you've ever seen? It probably isn't, but it is to me. And it matches our decor. Like, are you kidding me? It matches perfectly. What is, what is that? Oh God. Like right now I have these pillows. I hate this pillow. It's totally just the wrong color in this room. But I think, I don't know if I love these together. I might just put these for now. I don't know. I have this too. Hold on, let me. Let me stage it, let me stage it. Okay, and here's a better view of the wreath. Isn't she gorge? It's just very winter with the little berries. Pretty classic on the doormat. Welcome home. I think I've had this one before, but I got the bigger size. Um, I get a new, new doormat a few times a year just because they, they get really gross. You guys probably saw me grab this. If it doesn't work, I will return it. But um, I was thinking of putting it in the entryway instead of that wreath there, because the wreath's a little bit big. Um, and I have a different spot for that. I think this would look really cute on that wall. We'll see, I'll show you. Um, we needed bath towels for the downstairs bathroom. So since we did that green wallpaper, I got these because it has the same green right here and I just think it's really pretty. I think these are new. I got a bunch of Chobani flip as you saw. Oh, I got this hair clip because it's huge and I have really thick hair and often I have a hard time getting my hair to fit in the clip. And like, as my hair gets longer, it's just gonna get worse. <laughs> so um, this one looked, this is like the thickest clip I've ever seen. Like it's an extra large clip. So I'm hoping it'll just like fit everything. Oh, oh my God, this thing is massive. I have so much space. Usually it's like very overcrowded in the clip. Okay, if you have thick or long hair or thick long hair, get this I'll link it and the last thing I got is this marble tray for our uh, coffee table in the living room because right now I have the candlesticks and a little vase and I want to put them on here just so it looks a little bit more put together so let's set everything up since we're having everyone over tonight for New Year's Eve I want to have everything all organized and clean you chewing on your bone 
Are you chewing on your bone? Okay, see how cute? I like it better on the tray. I don't know. It's just, isn't it just doing something for you? It's doing something for me. Yes. Okay, we desperately need to have our couch cleaned, but don't judge me. But look at how good these pillows look. Oh, I love them. I love them, Bruno. I just, yeah, that's it for me. For sure. And this mirror is here. Oh, I love the way the living room is right now. So here is our living room setup post Christmas. I love the way it looks. We were thinking about maybe one day putting a console table back here, but it looks so pretty. I love it. It's so fresh and clean and yeah. Oh, that's one of his bombs. <laughs> it looks like poop. So over here we put this mirror. I think it'll be perfect for like, you know, outfit pics and vlogging and stuff. The blanket ladder. We got the old decor back. I touched up this paint. Some decor over here. Again, this painting is now over here. And yeah, that's that's the new living room setup. I totally love it. Bruno, you wanna play a game? You wanna play a game? Remember this? He loves this. So like you put treats under here and he has to try to get them out. Hide, seek, and treat. Okay, let's see. Let's see how you do. Okay, ready? Good luck. Let's see how it goes. Oh, you're doing a good job. You got one. Can you get the next one? You can do it. Oh, you took off one of the covers. No, but the tree is in here. <laughs> Come back. The tree is here, Bruni. All right, well, you'll figure it out. Okay, so I was just editing my 2022 favorites. It's going up tomorrow. And just finishing up some cleaning and stuff. And I'm gonna take a nap. <laughs> so we have to stay up till midnight um, for the party. So I'm gonna take a little nap with Bruno. Yes, I am. Yes, I am. We're having some of yours family and our friends over. It's gonna be super fun. So when I wake up, we're gonna put up the decorations, make a lasagna, and just get ready. I have to do my makeup too, but people aren't coming until eight, so we've got plenty of time. You wanna take a nap? Wanna take a nap with your mom? Oh, yes you do. Look at that baby. Guys, I'm gonna take Bruno out and it's raining. Come show your dad your raincoat. Isn't it cute? Yeah. It fits him perfectly. You wanna go for a walk? Cause when his fur gets wet, it takes forever to dry and then he gets stinky. Does that have a hoodie? Yes. <laughs> okay, I took my nap and I'm going to decorate now. It is 4.30, we have some time. I haven't really done anything else that I need to do. I need to cook, I need to decorate. And also I haven't even opened yet my ASOS package with my New Year's sweater. So I hope it fits and looks good. It was honestly exactly what I was looking for. Sequins and feathers. <laughs> like, it's just giving. Okay, let's look at it. Oh, it's so iconic. Look how good. Look how good this is for New Year's. Are you kidding? It's got like this fun kind of sweetheart neckline. And then these glittery feather sleeves. Are you kidding? It's gonna look so good. I think I'm just gonna wear it with some jeans. So I'm not like too wild. Okay, let's put up these decorations. guys decorations are done so i got this blow up bottle honestly i could have even bought more but i'm glad i didn't <laughs> so i've got this nye sign up here i'm definitely going to save um some of this stuff for next year so because that's like a nice banner it's like really good quality so we've got that this for taking pics i thought people could like take pics um against here because it has like the little bottles and stars literally this is missing and like it's not even like in there like i didn't even break it so i don't know but it'll be cute for pics then over here i put this banner happy new year i put my balloons over here i feel like they look cute in this little area over here i made this little like platter of like party stuff so like little hats and necklaces 
hats here, little blowers, and then the cookies and cupcakes down here. Then we have the plates, napkins, and cups. Oh, and I think I'm gonna move the chips over here too, so it's like a little snack station. Put the chips in the bowls, cute. And then I put the disco balls here, and then the Happy New Year sign over there, because I already had a nail. So there it is. It looks so cute. Okay, after much debate and changing, um, you guys should probably go watch the reel I put on TikTok and Instagram if you want to just see the struggle. I am sorry I didn't vlog it. I have just been vlogging so much because of Vlogmas and I feel like I've been neglecting TikTok and Instagram, but I did like a get ready with me and pick an outfit. And guys, the top from ASOS fit horribly. I don't know what happened. Like it's like the, the bust was so tight, even when I took off my bra. And like, I don't even have, I have pretty small boobs, especially for a plus size lady. So I tried on a bunch of outfits. I ended up going with this top that I've been wanting to wear for so long from ASOS as well. It's from River Island. And then I put on some black trousers. So it's like a really comfortable outfit because I just wanted to wear something shimmery. Um, I switched to gold jewelry for the night and that's, that's the fit. I'm currently making a lasagna because um, like we're doing a kind of potluck. I think I've said that a million times. This is a great, it's a great spot to film. I put on the New Year's special it starts at eight, I think it's 745. So yes, we're cooking, we're getting it, getting it moving. Yours in the shower and that's that. <laughs> um, I'll see if I take any clips tonight, but there's a solid chance I might just take the night for myself, especially after Vlogmas, your girl just needs to have a good night. Oh, the water's boiling over. Many hours later. Many hours later. It is 12.30 a.m. Everyone just left. Yar is driving his family back to their hotel. They're in town visiting. So he just left. I'm gonna do a quick little cleanup so when he gets back, we can just go to bed. Uh, I didn't take any clips, but we had a really nice night. It's funny that I'm in the same spot. We have lots of leftovers. Bruno is so confused. He's like, it is 12.30. I go to bed at 9.30. What's going on? I actually, I have some energy, oddly enough. So let's get this cleaned up so we can go to bed and feel refreshed in the morning and have a fresh morning tomorrow. so tired you guys Yara and I are having a lazy day we slept in um we didn't get to bed till like 1 30 um and yeah Bruno slept in too like we all just we're all just taking it slow I think Yara and I are gonna just binge watch some tv today some of the shows we're behind on so I'm really glad I cleaned last night though that was worth it because when I got up it was clean and it just felt really really good also, Yar's bringing up the correct paint because when I touched up the paint by the fireplace, uh, we have like off white on the wall, and then like the accents are white white, and I did the wrong ones. And last night we looked and we're like, you can actually really see the difference when it's uh the wrong one. So, uh, yeah. <laughs> it, did you notice how it showed worse at night? At night, it looked like gray on white. It was so bad. It's driving us both crazy. So is, what's this one called? Extra white? Cashmere? Cashmere? Sherwin Williams. Williams. Oh, it's extra white, yeah. Oh my god. Happy New Year. Happy New Year. Happy New Year. He had a night last night. He was so overwhelmed because it was just so many people. But he did good. You did good, baby. Mm -hmm. You did good last night. I know. Now back to the normal group. Back to the normal group. I saw that picture you posted on Instagram. Yeah. Like he was so face. little, yeah. wasn't he? So small. He, has a <laughs> he has a Cheeto on his leg. <laughs> Bruno. <laughs> that, that's rich. Oh, he wants it. He thinks this is a tree. Look at him sitting down. Oh, I'm sorry. You want your advent calendar. Okay. Gotta keep the Vlogmas tradition alive, even though it's January. Good night, baby.
You don't want it. Okay. I am painfully tired. Bruno, I'm so tired. Oh my god. So I've been watching Dead to Me. I'm on episode five. <laughs> Yarwin got into like a project and he was like, I don't know how I don't know how this man has energy right now. I really don't. <laughs> He's leaf blowing the garage. <laughs> I don't know how he has energy. Oh, I forgot to put my ring on. Um, but like he woke up like just in high spirits. He slept like I don't even know. He slept six hours, but he drank more than I did. Cause I can't drink much now. He's just thriving. He's thriving. Um, but I can't, I can't relax anymore. It's almost four o'clock. I need to get out of the house. So he needs to go to Lowe's and I was doing research. It seems like Walmart has my sugar-free peppermint mocha creamer. Cause I can't find it anywhere as you know, and I'm just not ready to let it go. I'm really not. So I might pick up a few, honestly. Um, and it'll just feel good to get out for a little bit. I can't. I can't relax as long because like now I have a headache. Does anyone else get that way? Like if you kind of relax too long, you get like a headache. I don't know. I did take the dog for a walk a little while ago, but. Oh, God. Can I give you your thing? One thing. Oh, the opener? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, hell yeah. Oh, that's nice. Yarman got me a garage door opener, which is very exciting. Because we've been using an app. We need to caffeinate. We're going to share a yerba. What are you doing? I just scanned the QR card to look at some of the options. Tell me why we're looking at friggin' sheds at Lowe's right now. Well, that's a, a rabbit hole that I'm going to get into tonight. We would like a shed. So, it might be a good idea, actually. Alright, Yar and Bruno in, are in the car. I am on my mission for my sugar-free peppermint mocha creamer. Let's pray for the best. They only have the regular, not the sugar-free. I mean, honestly, there's not that much sugar in it. But I don't know if it would make me feel sick or not. I was really trying. I was really, I was excited. I think it's over. Okay, you guys, I just took a shower. I have a towel on. <coughs> All right, so I am not ashamed to say I watched the entire season three of Dead to Me today and it felt so good. I haven't just like had a day to just like rest and rejuvenate in so long. Um, I'm gonna throw on this mask, a Pop Beauty Jet Setter Anti-Fatigue Mask. It's hydrating and it's one of those masks that you leave on and then just wipe off the ex excess after 10 to 15 minutes you do a thick layer so it's just gonna be super hydrating mm, it smells good so we're just gonna let this hydrate the skin i think i'm gonna do a foot mask tonight too the one from amo pay that was in my 2022 favorites if you didn't watch that video yet it's definitely worth checking out because i shared all my favorite products of the whole year. So this one has ceramide NP vitamins and antioxidants. It's replenishing, rejuvenating, reinvigorating, reinvigorating. But you guys, Dead to Me season three, I had to watch like a recap on YouTube. I found like the perfect recap. It was like five minutes and it recapped season one and two and it, it just jogged my memory because that's the issue when like a new show comes out. I'm like, I don't remember what's going on. So it was really good. It was, they're only 30 minutes each. I think in total it was five hours, <laughs> but I was on and off the couch all day just watching um, and it was great. <laughs> you know, we went out for a little bit, which was good, but I just needed today. Vlogmas kicked my butt. I had the best month, like truly one of my favorite vlogmas. It's probably my favorite um, of all time. And I just needed today definitely was much needed felt so good and the finale of dead to me there's not gonna be a season four i'm not gonna spoil it but your girl was crying and it was really really good i'm gonna miss that show but next on my watch list um which i definitely won't be able to do another like full binge day because tomorrow we're going to my grandma's for christmas with um my relatives that were sick with covid on christmas so because we're doing like secret santa white elephant stuff like that and she's gonna make a full christmas dinner um 
yeah, so we're treating tomorrow like Christmas with the fam. I don't think I'll vlog. And I'm gonna bring bingo, <laughs> so that'll be fun. Just kind of get back into my regular work groove. I have a lot of organizing that I need to do because I want to kick off this year with the house being organized. So stay tuned for like a cleaning, organizing, dedicated video. So that'll be fun. All right, you guys, that's the end of this vlog. I will see you guys again in a couple days and follow me on Instagram because I post there pretty much every day on stories and whatnot. So I love you and I'll see you soon. Bye.